Let's talk about the connected customer experience. Have you ever tried explaining to your CEO what the next phase of your omni-channel solution should be? I have. Now, where to start? Maybe with the customer touch points. The most traditional aspect is, of course, the brick and mortar store. But can the sales assistant identify your customers and see their personal preferences from both online and in-store? Can personalized recommendations be made based on their shopping behavior, even for products that are not available in-store? And speaking of point of sale, your online shop has probably become your true flagship store. Hopefully you've already implemented basic omni-channel features such as store locator and click and collect. But do you display retail stock online? And how frequently does it update? Are your customers able to reserve a product online for them to pick up from their favorite store when it suits them best? Then there's mobile apps. Don't forget your customers who are on the go. Can they access their wish list and shopping basket across all platforms? And what about push notifications and in-store beacon technology? Of course, customer data is the backbone of your engagement with the customer. You probably collect it at various touch points. However, what do you do with this valuable information? Do you use it to interact with your customers? And if you do, is it on an individual level? Because keeping track of your customers is the key to personalization. One way of collecting customer data is with a loyalty program. Do you have one? Even if you do, can you follow your customers' purchases through their online activity, across into stores, onto their mobile devices, and then link all of this data to a single unique person? Some things will never change. The customer will still call if there is a problem. The new challenge is, can your agent still answer any question even as the service you're offering becomes more and more complex? What happens if your customer returns an online order in store and then calls to ask when he will get his refund? All of this data is collected at one central point, the order management system. The answer to all of these questions, centralizing all of your data into one unifying system for a seamless connection between all of your physical and digital touch points. In this single system, you process all inventory, order, product, pricing and customer data, key business logic and any other tools which supplement customer communication to provide a personalized customer experience. And of course, all that centralized data is reflected back through various touch points to your customer. And down here, the final piece of the puzzle, the background infrastructure and operations. This includes warehouse management, ensuring you can handle the consolidation of B2B and B2C inventory and finding potential synergies in your cross-channel cost model financial services, buy online, return in store. Managing the flow of customer money across channels requires a smart and proactive financial services setup. And last but not least, transport management. Intelligent order processes which enable you to ship from either store or warehouse, achieving more efficiency and faster lead times. And of course, all this data flows in both directions. Now, the final hurdle to creating an omni-channel solution in your organization, the ERP system. But don't panic, that remains untouched. And yet, it will be connected to all the data within the central OMS. How did we solve our omni-channel problem? I'll give you a hint. Ask Arvato. Good luck with your omni-channel future.